It's Jeopardy, and I'll tell you why, because I have so much of my pride involved in that game, and when I'm playing with someone else and I get it wrong, I'm like, ah! Or when you, when you know the answer but you don't say it, right? Drives me nuts. Was it last season on Mad Men when Peggy left and she was saying bye to Don Draper and he like kissed her hand and it was the, the sweetest moment. I don't know what it was about that entire thing. I was, I was in tears. Here Miss Sally. Paprika. Waiter, there is too much pepper on my paprika. I would be proud to partake of your, your pecan, pecan pie. Pecan pie. pie. Your pecan pie. Pecan pie. Wasn't everyone's Dylan McKay? Luke Perry, 90210? And then I recently just saw him like bicycling around like Hancock Park area in LA with his kids and I was like, that is so funny. I now feel really old. He's got kids and I no longer have a Luke Perry pillow. I had no business seeing Poison Ivy at the age that I did. And I don't know why. Oh, I can't. I, what was I doing there? I don't even think I, I don't even think I understood half of what was going on, but there was a, a lot of little bits out. Yasmin Bleeth. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I wrote what? Yasmin Bleeth. That's the only one I ever wrote. And then I saw her. I used to work at a frozen yogurt store in LA. It was my first job. It was called Humphrey Yogurt. And um, I saw her in the parking lot, and what do I say to her? The most ridiculous thing you could say. Oh my god, I, lo I love you so much. I loved you in that soft and dry commercial. The most important thing I put on is soft, smooth, and feels just like silk. She just looked at me very blankly, and was like, okay, thank you. And I walked very meekly back into Humphrey Yogurt. <laughs>